under the same roof once again. A museum in Nice is hosting works by both Picasso and Matisse, two masters and two friends whose works are displayed in the city that was often their source of inspiration. Pablo Picasso and Henri Matisse met for the first time in Paris. At 36 years old, the Frenchman was married with children, leading a contrasting lifestyle than that of the bohemian Spaniard. Despite their initial differences, their encounter would spark years of artistic complicity. Matisse and Picasso had a great friendship, a friendship that lasted over 50 years. They met in 1906 and continued to see each other until 1954. At the same time, it was also a rivalry, not the negative kind, but a healthy one, a real emulation between the two artists. Pushing each other to outdo one another, sometimes using the same subjects with a different take a dialogue or a competition. We witness the two artists communicating through their works. Picasso's Sleeping Woman with Shutters came one year after Matisse's 1935 painting, The Dream. This 1927 odalisque, a reply to the Spaniards' Woman with Tambourine. It's quite moving to see how they sent each other their art, to see their common sources of inspiration and the rivalry between the two artists. It's good that this exhibition shows the differences, but also what they have in common. When it comes to these groundbreaking contemporaries, it's hard to tell who influenced who. But the two greats did have one muse in common, the Mediterranean landscape.